Hey there guys, it's David here and I'm just going to film a little video today to show you how to go through the onboarding process after someone has signed up for the four week challenge, how we actually just put everything through for them and make sure it's a really smooth transition from them saying yes over the phone to getting them to their intro session, getting everything we need off them, making sure that we're all sorted to do all that. So first things first, you've just gone over the phone, they've said yes, you've explained to them over the phone what's going to happen moving forwards, they've hung up, it's time to actually do what we explained. So first thing we do, we go back into the active campaign for the body shapers. So maybe this is actually where you got their number off originally. Maybe you were already in, say, their profile here, and that's where their number is. Awesome. What you're going to do is go to the home page. So you could actually just click here. Either way, go back to the home page. You're then going to go to whatever list that person was in. So firstly, go lists up the top here. Once that loads, we'll go from list to, let's say they're in the four week fat furnace list we got here, 288, great. We click on the list and we search for their name and just make sure you obviously get the right person here in case there's two people's names. So uh, Sam, whatever, let's say her name was Sam. We had two Sam, so just make sure you probably check what date they were added. You know, chances are they were added not long after you made the call to them. So let's say that it is, uh, you know what, I'll use an example of someone that's not gonna get the email. So that might be a bit smarter. So let's go back to the lists. Because what we're doing is taking them from this list into the four week challenge program starter lists. And from there, they'll get an automated email that goes through some of the questions we want to know before they start. So I'm pretty sure I'll have some uh, fake accounts in here that I made to test out the funnels. Uh, let's see, there's a John in here. Right, John, Jonathan at hotmail.com. That is actually not a lead. That's something I put in myself. So let's say John here just signed up. Click John, edit. All selected, so just that one person. Add to list. We're going to add to the four-week challenge program starter list. Bingo, add to list. Fantastic. Apply changes to one contact. Beautiful. So if you were just the first few times, you might want to check it actually worked. All you have to do is go back to, oh, I'm sure I should have gone to lists there. Go back to list. You can go into the list you just added him to. Well, actually, you know what? If you do go back to there, it will tell you. Go away notification. If you go back to the home page, when you add someone to those new lists, it'll say here, subscribed, Jonathan at hotmail.com. If you were to click on him, you would see now, it's now subscribed to the list four week challenge starter. There, subscribe to this four week challenge starter and enter the automation and that would send the e automated email off. So that's what the first thing you wanna do because you would have said to them over the phone, hey, we're gonna email you through um, a few questions, you wanna make sure you get that to them so they know it's legit, and while they're in that state where they're probably gonna take action. Great, step number one is that. Step number two is sending them a little text message. So again, I like to do something on the, on the phone saying, we're gonna send you a message straight after this, confirming everything, something really quick so you know that they're, they've got it, they're all clear. So you already told them on the phone, you're gonna send them a quick text message, and this is the, uh, the document here going through these steps. You're gonna send them a little message below uh, just to confirm they offset anything. So here's the sample message I use most of the time. Just use this unless there's something interesting you have to say in it. So, hi name, David here. Obviously your name here. Great chatting to you. So the four week challenge will start on Monday, blah, blah, blah. Here's the address. Here's what time sessions we're doing. Here's what time I've got you in for the intro session, the day at the gym. Let them know they can drive in and park out the front. They'll receive that email that we've already sent to them um, to fill that out and just obviously adjust then that day there. Hope you're excited to see you then and make sure, it's very important, can you reply to this so I know you received it because people go walk about. So just say that at the end. Um, as I said, copy paste this message. Um, maybe type it out into your phone once and save it somewhere. Have that saved, send them that, put their name in, put the day and the date in and you're good to go. From there, we're gonna use the group calendar that we've got you in and I'm gonna get you to actually just add that person into the group calendar uh, that's on your phone um, as to what day they're doing the intro. So you'd go on the calendar really easy go into you know, Saturday intro session, 12 o'clock, add them in. You can't really go that too far off. If you're not sure, just ask. And then finally, if you've been taking notes on Evernote, like we advise, so sometimes, um, where am I? Let's go to Evernote. So Evernote's where we're gonna take notes on clients as we're talking to them, if you're on the computer. So here's a little test one that's made up. So you're on Evernote and you've been taking notes like we do. So test person for a challenge. Whatever notes you actually shake, you know, wants to lose 20 kilos, wants to do this, this, this. Uh, at the end of all your notes, make a note here of what intro session they're doing. So intro session, Saturday, 12 p.m., great. And then from there, you go to, where is it? Um, this one here, sorry. And 
I've already put this person in the four week challenge starter. So let's say they were in a different one. If they were in the first notebook there, just move them to four week challenge start. So now this note is now in the notebook here. Um, where are we? Notebooks, four week challenge starts. Beautiful, here it is. That's where I was originally. That will give me a chance to read through any notes you made on them and know which intro they're coming to and just so we know where they're all going. So put them into there. Once you've done all that, they're ready, good to go. You know, they'll turn up to their intro and we'll be sweet to go from there. So that's all for now. And uh, yeah, hope that all made sense. Talk to you soon.